Yes. Yeah. All right, what's going on people? Eddie Wynn back, and today we are gonna be talking about jogger pants. So by now, everyone has a pair of jogger pants. They are everywhere. So for the sake of this video, when I refer to jogger pants, I mean anything that has a cuff at the bottom of the leg. So are they played out? Yes, but are they completely dead? I don't think so. I do prefer tapered jeans and chinos over jogger pants, but I still think there is a place for certain joggers. Jogger pants like these that have an elastic cuff down towards the bottom, not a contrast like this. This is just an elastic cuff down towards the bottom of the leg. It's scrunched up. There's not a cuff stitched in here. These are completely dead. You can find these everywhere. Target, Marshalls, Ross, Urban Outfitters, American Apparel, American Eagle, anywhere. You can literally find these anywhere. I would not be surprised if they sell these in gas stations. These are the cheapest kind of joggers and these are done. These are over. I'm sorry, yo auntie, these are done. <laughs> the good thing about these being done is that they're probably the cheapest version of joggers out there price-wise, so you probably didn't spend too much money on them. This is just my opinion, by the way. Wear whatever you like, wear whatever makes you feel comfortable in what you think looks good. This is just my opinion. So these elastic cuff chinos, RIP. Funny story about these pants though. These were the first piece of clothing that any brand ever sent to me for free. They are from, what are these? I forget, I forget the name. Uh, they're from New Zealand, and uh, this was the first thing that ever got sent to me for free. They uh, sent over three pairs. I was super, super hyped that they sent them over. They got their money's worth, that's for sure, because I wore a black pair in my uh, Jordan Retro Collection video. That has like 700,000 views, and I was wearing a pair of their pants. All right, so next up, I'm gonna talk about these pants hanging behind me. These are Zane Robe Dynamo Chinos. Now, the difference between these and these is that there is a cuff stitched in down towards the bottom. It provides somewhat of a contrast. I don't think that these pants are completely dead yet. They might be soon, but I don't think they are totally dead. You can still rock a nice pair of runners with these and pull the look off. You know, New Balances, Asics, Sauconies, and some Pumas look really good with these still. However, they have to be completely on point. I think the Dynamo Chino is one of the best versions of these type of joggers. There's a lot out there. They've literally played these things to death. Stripes, different materials, all different types of shit. Don't play into any of the gimmicks. If there's stripes down towards the bottom of the cuff, no good. If the pants have like graffiti or some crazy design that's way over the top, no good. It has to be something simple and clean like this in my opinion, and you have to wear the right pair of shoes. You can't really wear Jordan 1s with these or like Tim boots or, or whatever. You should mostly stick to low top runners or low top lifestyle shoes like a suede or a Stan Smith, and even those are kind of a reach now. You literally have to have a specific look for these. Every once in a while, breaking them out with a good outfit I still think will work. Alright, so moving on to the last pair of jogger pants that I think aren't dead and are not played out. Joggers are the best thing to ever happen to sweatpants. These are Nike Tech Fleece. A lot of you guys probably have Nike Tech Fleece. It's the best thing to ever happen to Nike sweatpants in my opinion. I most likely won't ever wear a pair of sweatpants that don't have a cuff at the bottom. Nike absolutely crushed it with these sweatpants. They're a nice slim fit, it's good material. The bottom of the leg going into the cuff is a nice tapered fit. Same thing with these. These are a basic pair of gray sweatpants. They're from, uh, I think Frank and Oak, yeah Frank and Oak, nothing to them. They are just a basic plain pair of gray sweatpants, but they have a cuff at the bottom. It's a game changer. It's a small detail that completely changed the look of sweatpants. A lot of high-end designers are still making high-quality jogger sweats. Just check out John Elliott and other brands. So as far as sweatpants go with the cuff, I don't think that they are played out or dead. I think that these are probably on their way, but you can still pull them off if you have the right outfit. And again, the elastic cuff chinos, 
no good. RIP. All right, guys, so that is my take on jogger pants at the moment. My perspective could completely change by next year, but as of right now, mid-November 2015, those are my thoughts. I wanted to share it with you guys since a lot of people were leaving comments and I've seen it in other people's videos that joggers are dead, joggers are played out. Uh, this is just my opinion. If you think it looks dope, then do you rock that shit and don't listen to me. At the end of the day, joggers are super trendy. All trends come to an end at some point and other ones pick up. So keep that in mind anytime you see an upcoming trend, not to completely invest. It's okay to buy a couple things, but if you have 20 pairs of these chinos, all right, so that's it for the video. Go ahead and hit that thumbs up button for me if you guys like this style video. Leave a comment. Let me know what your thoughts are about joggers. Subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram tomorrow, Friday. Definitely make sure you're following me on Instagram. Uh, I've got a crazy day tomorrow. I don't really want to let the cat out of the bag now, but uh, I got invited to a certain footwear brand's headquarters that I am really excited about. I'm going to share it with you guys and make sure I vlog, all that good stuff. So make sure you're following me on Twitter and Instagram because I'm going to be sending some pictures out and then I'll probably post the vlog on Saturday or Sunday. That's it. I will talk to you guys later. Peace.